hello lovely naturals welcome to another video have you ever heard of hair paint wax well hair paint wax is a temporal hair dye that can be used on natural or colored hair here are some hair paint wax application tips for your natural hair begin with a clean dry hair before applying the wax make sure your hair is completely dry as wet hair can dilute the color and affect the overall result apply the wax to small section of your hair with your fingers or brush beginning at the root and working your way to the ends use caution when applying if you're not careful hair paint wax can be sticky and cause tangles to avoid damaging your hair, take your time and apply the wax gently. Use a hair dryer or let it dry naturally. After applying the wax, use a hair dryer in a low heat setting to help set the color. You can also let your hair dry naturally. Avoid over application. Hair paint wax is meant to be used sparingly. You don't use too much. A small amount goes a long way and too much can make your hair look greasy and way down. The last step is be prepared for a little bit of transparent here and there. Since hair paint wax is a temporal hair color product, it may transfer onto your clothes or your bedding. To reduce this transfer, avoid touching your hair too often and make sure the hair is completely dry. Moreover, using hair paint wax to add temporal color to your natural hair can be a lot of fun. To achieve the best result, follow the instruction carefully and take your time. You may also ask, is it safe for the natural hair? Hair paint wax is generally considered safe for use on natural hair, but there is always the risk of potential side effects or allergic reactions. As with any hair product, here are things to remember. The first one is to do a patch test before applying the hair wax to your entire hair. Apply a small amount of wax to a small section of your hair and wait for at least 24 hours to see if you have any hurtful or allergic reaction. Look out for irritation. Some poor, particularly those with sensitive skin, may experience scalp irritation or itching from hair paint wax. If you experience any discomfort, redness, or swelling, immediately rinse the wax off and stop using it. Excessive use of hair paint wax can cause damage to your natural hair, especially if you apply it frequently and leave it for long periods of time. Follow the instruction carefully. Excessive use of hair paint wax can cause damage to your natural hair especially if you use it frequently or leave it in your hair for long periods you have to also look out for staining hair paint wax can stain your clothes bedding or other surfaces but it can also be easily removed use these bonus steps to achieve brighter colors no matter what color you use using hair paint wax on natural hair to achieve a brighter look can be a fun and creative way to experiment with color. Here are some hair paint wax tips to help you achieve a bright and bold look. Begin with a light colored hair. Hair paint wax works best on light colored hair or bleach hair because it is more vibrant. If you've got dark hair, you need to bleach it first to achieve a brighter look. Use a good amount of wax to achieve a brighter bold look. Use a considerate amount of hair paint wax on your hair. Apply the wax to small sections of your hair with your fingers or brush beginning at the root and working your way down to the end. The next step is to layer the colors. If you want a multicolored look, layer different colors of hair paint wax. Apply one color at a time, letting it dry before moving on, on to the next. Use a hair dryer on low heat setting to set the color and achieve a brighter look. To avoid damaging your hair, keep your dryer at least 6 inches away from it. Do not touch your hair too often after application. Hair paint wax can transfer onto clothing, bedding, and other surfaces. So try not to touch your hair too often after application. This will ensure that the color remains as bright and vibrant as possible. Thank
you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video like comment and subscribe see you in another video Thank you.